Is the lighting good? Yeah. Pretty good lighting in this round. Newspaper. Failed. Newspaper. Nailed it. Oh, I should have sprayed my hair today. Be right back. I'm gonna spray my hair real quick. <laughs> I meant to do that. Does it show good in like in the camera? There he's pretty. Oh, I got a bad camera, so well, I really don't it's just that this is the only camera I got storage on and it's the computer camera. That's some proof that it's actually there. That's the paint. It's red. It's red. It's pinkish. And I'm wondering how you could turn that into a permanent. Because I just made a peace sign. Um. Ah! I have to delay my video. Since it's thunderstorming. Hopefully it's not hail again. It's hail just drives me nuts. Even though I did it one time every single year in Cheyenne. One time every summer at least. And that's what it mostly does whenever it hails. Okay, so I still have three um plants and don't make a regular paper pot out of four pieces of paper because it'll leave a hole easily and newspaper is just more waterproof and why I added tin foil instead of do the whole thing normally is because um when it grows it's gonna it's gonna grow strong and tall Taller than I expected. I'm gonna give it like one week of the tinfoil gonna be on there. And, uh, it's basically my update already. And I got another one right here. That means we get to make a pot. Okay, since if you guys don't know how to plant, how to plant these lemon seeds, just poke your finger in there, put it in that hole that your finger left in there, 
then try to scoot some dirt onto there. Try to cover as much crash as you can and push down hard as you can. Everywhere. I mean, like, everywhere. And it's not really that deep, but who cares? I don't really want to waste. Since I'm rent in renting the house, my dad is, um, so we don't get to really do that much dirt. Is I thought. Whoa! I almost dropped my pot. Now I'm gonna go right to rich. I normally do is cover the top, the whole top, with a thin layer, and then I try to scooch it everywhere by going side to side like this. And yeah, I'm gonna go put tin foil on it. What I try to do is make it at least a little bit bigger than a hole, then try to scoot it into the hole. So, so it's gonna be hard for the seat to um go in there, go above. Try to cover as much dirt as you can with this. And yeah, the lemon seedling will try to get out. And I made two other pots. Um, um, so when it grows bigger, I can use these ones. I, I'm guessing it might take about a week to grow a um, lemon tree when it's already in the pot. So, yeah. I just like being lazy and make the homemade pots. <laughs> Wait, I meant that. Instead of being lazy and then buying pots. Then buying pots. Okay. Gotta fold it into it. It's small square. Yeah. So it's only like me. Kind of a square, kind of. I'm using a USA paper, just so you know. Okay, can you, can you see? Yeah, the lighting is bad in this room. I'm in a different room with a bigger table. Move it back and then go like this. Can you see it? And then hold this part, this thin part in half. Oh, by the way, whenever you use it, try to go to this side where it doesn't, or it doesn't have where you can go like that, or you can go like that. With the newspaper. You got to turn to break it. Pull this part back. Okay, and then pull this until it lines up to this line right here. And then pull this part. And then flip this over. Whoa. Try not to be uncareful and try to break it. And uh, go like that on the side. And go like that. And try to go like this. It will it will help it, but you you necessarily need to do this. Sorry if I don't punctuate a word, 
It's because, yeah, I still cannot punctuate words. Punctuate words. Okay, go like that. It is fully over. And then... And then try to tuck it in this side with the more room. Not that at this side where it folds backwards. Tuck it at the side that has more room. Then open it. Go like that. And then show ya. Guys, be careful, don't make too many pots. If you will. It's it's um it's pretty hard to not because it's pretty addicting after you make like the first five. And guys, I did do overdo it. Yep, I reached the addicting point. Now I'm just gonna make a pause on the video. Yeah. This is my pot collection right here. And my seeds are all the way back here. Ugh. Should organize it, not really. And my seeds are in here. You guys see if there's any one other ones with the stems in it yet? With that with that um root sticking out. I'm gonna include it. Um, there's no date really. It's gotta get close to eight days. Then you gotta look at your seeds. Be before it reaches when it reaches like the sixth day, you should start checking on them. Yeah. Then, I like to do it on the seventh day, but um. But I really shouldn't do it that way. You should really do it on the seventh day after that, and then do it repeatedly, repeatedly. Nope, there's none with no stems. There's none with stems. I don't have any with stems yet. Except for that one. I checked it early and I wanted to check it earlier again to make sure. I'll try to do as most secure as I can so it will be enough of a check for it to not open up on accident and then, yeah, then throw out all the seeds. this video I'm gonna quit recording then gonna turn off all the lights during the thunderstorm and go mess around with stuff that don't have electricity turn off everything that has electricity close all the windows Yeah, I'm already having some random computer problems. I'm gonna turn off all the lights. Oh, that looks so creepy. There. And I'll see you guys after the thunderstorm. Peace. Peace out, folks.